Hey guys, it's the one and only Bougie Marie. And your boy, Do Crack J. But um, today we're reacting to <laughs> SML movie, Jeffy Gets Knocked Out. But, what? Jeffy Gets Knocked Out? Yeah, I seen him get knocked out before, too. Who? Who? Yeah. Oh, you don't remember it, that's why. But yeah. Who knocked me out? Yo, shit. I forgot her name. Who knocked me out? Somebody. Bro, ain't nobody ever knocked me out. Hey, you say it, but I witness it. Witness what? You getting knocked out. By who? You already know. When was this? Shit, 2015-ish, 16-ish. When was in high school? I never fought in high school. That's yeah. Bro. Yep. You got right there under the chin. I seen that shit. Like, damn. Bro, I never fought a day in life in high school. Bro, play the video. Play the damn video. But before we get to the video, make sure you guys hit that like button and subscribe to turn the post notifications and then get straight into the video. Oh man, I'm so sick. Is there anything I can get you, Marvin? Uh, I think I'm gonna need more tissues. Okay. Hey, Nate, can I show you my SpongeBob Giggle Blaster? That's really cool, Jeffy. I'm playing with it. Um, I'm really sick. Can you play with it tomorrow? No, no, I cannot. It has to be today. Jeffy, Marvin doesn't feel well. Too bad. I have an appointment to play with my SpongeBob Giggle Blaster, and I want to show Daddy what it does. What does it do, Jeffy? SpongeBob creams. Okay, I did not expect that. I did not expect that at all. That's wild. Just creamed. He's SpongeBob cream pants, and I just pooped. So I'm a SpongeBob poop pant. Jeffy, you made a huge mess. You better go get some napkins and clean all this up. Uh. Here you go, Daddy. Here's your paper towel. All right, Jeffy, start cleaning up the mess. Too hard. No, it's not too hard, Jeffy. Grab a paper towel and wipe it up. My hands don't work. They work when you're playing with the SpongeBob Giggle Blaster. Well, that was fun. This isn't. Jeffy, I'll clean it up, but go get Marvin a thermometer. He might have a fever. Okay. Baby, you don't have to clean this up. Jeffy did it. It's okay, Marvin. Here, Daddy. Here's your thermometer. But I'm feeling kind of sick, so can I take my temperature first? Hurry up. <sighs> Jeffy, you stick out of your butt. Uh-huh. Jeffy. Call me crazy, but I would never do that to my baby. Because you know how the thermometer puts a check in a butt? I would not. I'm, I can't do that. That's, that. That would be violating my child. I can't do it. It's either going under their armpit or under their tongue. Mm -hmm. I'm glad my... You know what? I can't even say that because I just pray my mom never did that to me and my brother. Marvin, I think you should go see a doctor. I really think you should. <laughs> It's no. the shitty thermometer for me. What would you do if somebody actually did that to you? Accidentally? Well, purposely did that. Bro. <laughs> I got a Glock for a reason. <laughs> I got a Glock for a reason. I mean, you probably will. I would definitely shoot them. And when the police, what happened, I'm going to tell them straight up. I mean, self -defense. technically, that is self-defense. Because that, that is a self. That is a self. Like. What? Technically. I wouldn't hesitate. <laughs> Boom. Okay. 
It's not some be some form of brutality right here. No. Very much so. <laughs> Very much so. Uh-uh. All right, guys. Are you ready to play dodgeball? Heck yeah, dude. <laughs> we haven't started yet. Yeah, Judge, we didn't start yet. Ooh, my bad. I'm just ready. You guys ready to play dodgeball? Bro, Dodgeball used to be so crucial. Yeah. Alright, Cody, who's gonna be on your team? Because me and Judge are gonna be on the team. Well, that's not fair. That's two against one. Well, you gotta find a teammate. Well, do you think Chef Pee would want to be on my team? Is he even good at dodgeball? I don't know. Alright, how about we throw a dodgeball at him and see if he's good at dodging it? Okay. Mm-mm-mm, my hibachi stir fry looks almost done. Man, it looks so delicious. I just love watching it cook. <laughs> Chef Pee just got wrecked. Wow, cooking? Is that really who you want to be your teammate? No, I guess not. Wow, cooking? To be fair, he didn't even know we were playing. That's what I would do. Yo, bro. It's <laughs> Trifling. Why they cooking? Trifling. Hey, if you suck at dodgeball, good dodgeball players are always looking out for balls. Yeah, I guess so. Right? That's why like you're a good dodgeball player. You're always looking for balls. <laughs> yeah, I sure do. You, you want to go see if Jeffy will be your teammate? Okay. Hey, Jeffy, you want to play dodgeball? Well, have you seen Jeffy? Ooh, look, a thermometer. I'm going to take my temperature. I think I'm getting sick. Yeah, this has been in someone's ass. Are you sick? <laughs> <laughs> Where's Jeffy? It's the fact, you and you still got it in your mouth, my guy. Jeffy, what are you a cage? My mommy and daddy don't trust me, so they put me in a cat cage. Why don't they trust you? Because they say I break things. Well, Cody needs a partner in dodgeball. You want to play? Sure. You just gotta let me out of the cage. All right, Cody, let him out of the cage. Okay. Okay, we got our teams for dodgeball. So the rules are: if you get hit with the ball, you're out. Okay. Three, two, one, go! Right. Throw it, Joseph! Throw it! <laughs> Just breaking everything in the house. Oh no, it's just a bees! Come on, we gotta grab the ball! Yeah. Alright, Cody, I got the ball. Hold on, let me see where they're at. Ain't nothing like indoor dodgeball. Right. Okay, Jeffy, the defense, let's hit him. Oh. They really just broke that base. Oh, no, no, Julia, what's up? Oh, bro, speak to me! Speak to me, please! Oh, I'll binge me, Joseph. He killed him. Who doesn't care about the elderly? So I 
can't have the medicine. Oh, you can have the medicine. It's just by taking the medicine, <laughs> you're admitting you're a weak little pussy bitch who doesn't like the elderly. But I mean, personally, I wouldn't take it because I'm not a weak little pussy bitch who doesn't care about the elderly. But you, I don't know. We'll see. Wow. Okay, so you're admitting you're a weak little pussy bitch who doesn't care about the elderly. Uh, I just, I'm just tired of the no, cough. No, it's, it's fine. It's fine. It's just if you're gonna take that medicine, I need to record a video of you saying you're a weak little pussy bitch who doesn't care about the elderly. Marvin, let's just go. What? <laughs> I'm tired of the coughing. You don't need the medicine. What? I'm a weak pussy bitch who doesn't care about the elderly. Okay, got it. Thank you. Marvin, Marvin, I can't believe you took that medicine. Baby, I'm tired of. <laughs> I need to get better. But there's a global shortage. There's no shortage. It's just something Jeez, they say bro. to save money. I don't know, Marvin. All right, Jeff, it's time to get out of the cage. Jeff, hey. Marvin, maybe he's sleeping. Jeff, hey, wake up. Get out of your cage. Baby, open the cage. Okay. Drag him out. Come on, Jeffy. <laughs> Jeffy, wake up. Jeffy? Jeffy, wake up. Marvin, he's not waking up. Wake up, Jeffy. Marvin, we should call a doctor. No, he's, he's just faking it. Who oh, no. knows? Call doctor! Okay. Call doctor! Hey, somebody call a doctor? Yes, doctor, my son. Oh, look who it is! The weak little pussy bitch who doesn't care about the elderly. You know, I put that video online. It already has 10 million hits. People hate you. Man. Listen, my son's knocked out. He's not moving. Let me see if he has a pulse. Well, he's got a pulse. He's still alive. Okay, so what, what do we do? Well, tell me what happened. All right, so we went to the hospital to see you because of my cough, you know? We put him in his cage, and then we got back... Hold up, I'm sorry. You, you put your son in a cage? Yeah, yeah, so we put him in a cage when we leave because we don't want him to break stuff. You, you're telling me you put your son in a cage? Well, yeah, because, like, he likes to break stuff. We don't want him roaming around. So, so, so how, how old is he again? He's 18 years old. So you put a grown man in a pet taxi? Well, listen, we put him in the cage to protect him because, you know, he likes to break stuff, make messes, so we just put him in a cage for, like, a few hours. Well, that maybe that's why he passed out is because he didn't have a lot of circulation in the pet taxi and, and you didn't leave him any food and water. Did you at least let him use the litter box before you put him in there? Well, listen, no, he usually can hold it for a long time. You know, I'm thinking maybe I should be putting on my cop outfit. Well, no, no, you don't need your cop outfit. He likes the, 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 the cat cage. Marvin, maybe Jeffy needs some water. I'm going to go get him some. Yeah, I guess the water. Yeah, and while she does that, I'm gonna put my cop uniform on. No! no Jeffy, tell, tell him you like the cage. Wake up! Alright, I am dressed to arrest. Now, you better tell me that cage thing was some kind of joke, but I can see the cage, so, I mean, you're pretty guilty. Wait, 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 Marvin! I found a bunch of broken glass downstairs and this dodgeball! What? A dodgeball, you say? You know, in high school, I was a dodgeball champion. I knocked out all the other kids. You know what? I'll tell you what. I challenge you to a one-on-one -on -one dodgeball game. If you beat me, I won't arrest you. But if I beat you, not only will I arrest you, I'm taking your medicine too. Come on, Marvin. You don't want to be arrested, do you? But it's the medicine they're taking for me. But what do you have to lose? Huh, Marvin? Come on. You want to get arrested or play me? I guess I'll play you in dodgeball. Yes. Oh, you're going to get creamed. All right, Marvin, I blindfolded myself because my old coach Patches O'Houlihan taught me if you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. Okay? One, two, three, go! <laughs> Got you, slut! Now you're out! Well, Marvin, you won fair and square. I guess I probably shouldn't have worn it. took out his <laughs> whole eye. Unless I actually did hit you and you were lying. No, you didn't even come close to hitting me. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I want to rescue them. Uh, oh, Jeffy, uh, are you okay? What happened? I'll tell you what happened. You locked him in that cage. That's what happened. Yeah, no more cage. Yeah, you better get rid of that cage unless you want to get arrested. All right, fine. I won't put Jeffy in a cage anymore. Good. And we all learned a lesson because I will never wear a blindfold while playing dodgeball again. <laughs> You gonna take that medicine? Yeah, I really want to. Weak little pussy bitch. <laughs> what is the worst pain you have ever felt? <sighs> when I went to basic training, that's all I'm gonna say. When I got uh, shot nine times. Probably for real. Many, Cause many. we know you. Many, 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 many. With death on me. What? Power. Nah. No, it is the worst pain I ever felt. The Razor uh, scooter. When it hits your ankle. Oh, bro, you're bringing back memories. Man, nah, that's the worst pain I ever felt. Me trying to do a, do a flip, I mean, do a little trick. Bang. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, definitely. That's not it. Worst but pain. Yeah. Anyways, if you guys have anything for us to react to, please put it in the comments down below. Yes, like, sir. comment, subscribe, share. 
Turn on your post notifications and our social medias will be in the description down below. And we're out, guys. Peace. Bye.